What is Udra Vigilance and how it works? Udra Vigilance is a big system that helps to keep track of the safety of medicines in Europe. It collects and analyzes information about adverse drug reactions that people may experience after taking any medicines. The adverse drug reactions might be mild, like a headache, or serious, like a heart attack. Udra Vigilance is run by the European Medicines Agency, which is an organization that works with the governments of different European countries to make sure that medicines are safe and effective. Udra Vigilance also works with other entities who are involved with medicines, such as Marketing authorization holders, these are the companies that manufactures and sell the medicines. They have to report any adverse drug reactions that they know about or find out from their customers or doctors. The another entity is, sponsors of clinical trials. These are the people who test new medicines before they are approved and sold. They have to report any adverse drug reactions that happen to the people who take part in their studies. The third entity is, National Competent Authorities. These are the government agencies that are responsible for regulating medicines in each country. They have to report any adverse drug reactions that they receive from doctors, pharmacists, patients, or other sources. The last but not the least entity is, doctors, pharmacists, patients, or anyone else who uses a medicine. They can also report any adverse drug reactions that they experience or observe after taking a medicine. Udra Vigilance has two main parts. The first part is Udra Vigilance Clinical Trial Module. This is where the sponsors of clinical trials report the adverse drug reactions that happen during their studies. These reports are called Suspected Unexpected Serious Adverse Reactions. They are unexpected because they are not listed in the investigator's brochure of the medicine, and serious because they can cause death, disability, hospitalization, or other major problems. The second part is Udra Vigilance Post Authorization Module. This is where the marketing authorization holders and national competent authorities report the adverse drug reactions experienced by people after medicine is approved and sold. These reports are called Individual Case Safety Reports. These ICSRs can be expected or unexpected, serious or non-serious. Udra Vigilance also has a big database where it stores all these ICSR reports. It has some tools and functions built in that allow people to search and analyze the safety and efficacy data of the particular medicines. This helps to find out if there are any new or serious issues with a medicine or if it works well for different kinds of people. For example, Udra Vigilance can help to compare the number and type of adverse drug reactions between different medicines or groups of people. Identify any patterns or trends in the data over time or across different regions. Detect any signals or warnings that may indicate a possible safety issue with a medicine. Udra Vigilance also shares some of its data with the public. Anyone can access some information about the adverse drug reactions reported for each medicine on the EMA website. This helps people to make informed decisions about their health and their use of medicines. If you want to know how you can access safety profile of any medicine on EMA website please comment down below and I will create a separate video on this. If you want to learn about the ICSR reports in detail please check the video displayed on the screen. That's it for today's video. Please hit a like button if you like the video and provide your valuable comment in the comment box. Also subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notification. Thanks for watching the video.